Okay, we're going to be doing a needling for a Veruca, plantar aspect, first metatarsal right foot. And we're going to use this ethyl chloride spray to temporarily numb the skin before the injection. Okay, here we go. I get it nice and frosty and cold. Just relax. Relax. Okay, nice and cold. Okay. okay, you're going to feel a burning sensation. Doing great. Doing great. Just relax. Just relax there. There you go. We're just going to draw a wheel of. Uh, this is half percent marking plane. We're going to put in about three to five cc's in here slowly. Can move the needle underneath each of the warts. How are you doing? Doing okay? Mm -hmm. All right. It's Monday, right? Monday. This is Monday. This is wart day today. Not Monday, wart day. I get this whole area. There we go. You stop. Okay, we painted this with betadine, put a fenestrated drape on, and we're going to do the needling procedure. So the technique, I'm going to needle each of the, I'm going to go down until we get bleeding. You feeling that at all? Mm -hmm. And you got multiple little pin pricks. You go on. Just very faint. Through the point of resistance here. Do the big one first. Since we've got the whole an area anesthetized, I'll go ahead and do the other two also. And I'll just keep going until I feel very low resistance in the remaining areas. I'll go to this one. Got three here. We'll just make each of them, and you're basically looking to get them about the consistency of like a kind of a beefy red hamburger. You want bleeding. Bleeding is what. We no, we've driven the virus underneath the underneath the dermis into the sub-Q fat, and that's the way we get the body to recognize the virus and get rid of the infection. I'm going to get the last few of these. And then you'll do this one a little bit more. But you guys can feel the areas. What you'll do when you've gone through the area that you've gone through before would be less resistance. And you're just trying to get a number of different angles on this just to make it so that the whole ward is being needled. Alright. So we will just wipe that up and you can see at the end there what it looks like that's what it looks like it'll be it'll bleed a little bit but really there's it's just you're just kind of poking holes in these warts so that we get the virus in the bloodstream so the body will recognize and get rid of it on its own all right and that's all there is to it